everyone, welcome to, uh, to Cast. My name's Automo, and I'll be casting this pub game. It's actually a few days old, but it still should be, you know, still in this meta. 6.85, so it should be alright. So let's look at the two lineups. On the uh, radiant side, we have Porta on the tiny. We have Zeus. Looks like he's going to be going mid, being, ba being played by Pandy Low with no items. Uh, Pudge being played by WGMM. Slardar on the inter. Uh, being played by International and lastly we have Anonymous on the Outworld Devourer um, looks like most of the Dare team haven't actually picked yet or at least they're not moving which is a bit odd uh, so I'm gonna wait a little before introducing them looks like um, Rachel Spirit wants to try and get this top group but I don't think she's gonna get might be better if she went bottom actually and we'll see what happens here I don't. I think the Raiden are probably gonna get both the ru Ruins and yeah, Pudge gets the top and Tiny gets the bottom. Life still has finally reconnected. Welcome to the game. I wonder what this Life Stealer is going to do. Still hasn't picked actually. Yeah, there's something odd with the dire side. They don't seem to actually all be here for some reason. Um, but anyway, looks like Centaur is going to go top. I'm not sure about this item, but honestly, the. The items this game seem a bit strange to me. Then again, this is normal skill, not the very high skill bracket that you see. So let's go through the lineups. Tiny is okay, of course. We have no courier, but eh, whatever. He has boots, he has iron branches, that's pretty much it. Zeus, no items at all, kind of just roaming around. You generally want to take Arc Lightning level 1 because the damage is the same as Lightning Bolt, almost the same, but the cooldown is way shorter, so it does more damage overall. Uh, Slardar's top lane, uh, no regen, but who needs it? What about Pudge? Pudge is mid. Has bottle, has tangos. Looks like he should be okay, I guess. I don't know. Um, yeah, still no Korea. That's the thing that I find weird. Oh, might be able to get the kill on the Vengeful Spirit. No, it should be fine. I've never seen the Pudge versus VS mid matchup before, so I'm not sure exactly how well it goes. OD's top lane, looks like he's gonna go for Arcane Orb. Generally, you wanna max out Astral Imprisonment and Essence uh, Aura, so uh, he's buying the Courier, Tank goes, healing stuff. Alright, so this will be a very interesting game. One more hit will kill the Pudge. Can Vengeful Spirit get it? She could have. Uh, whoa, okay, okay. She had the animation going, by the way. Look at this. She had the animation. Look very closely. She looks like she's about to hit him. She. Uh, starts the attack and decides not to kill him. Mercy shown this day by the Vengeful Spirit, I suppose. Anyway, Vengeful Spirit has... I think she also could have used Wave of Terror to kill him. Anyway, Vengeful Spirit 1-1-1. Um, no last... only one last hit, so... Weird mid lane Vengeful Spirit. Uh, Omnite's top, he has the Purification, Degen Arrow, and also has Ring of Regen. Okay... Lifestealer is going to the jungle. Looks like he uh, takes, of course, Feast. He takes Scout Shield, Quilling Blade. Yeah, that's pretty much how you want to build him in the forest. So he should be okay, I suppose. Takes Rage. I'm not really sure which one's better, Rage or Open Wounds for jungling. They both seem pr relatively the same. Center Warrior, no regen. Has a cloak. God knows why, because uh, he's. The cloak actually is completely worthless this lane. I mean. The Slither Crush is, dam is physical damage, and the Arcane Orb is pure, so it blocks nothing. I'm really not sure what he's trying to build. Kind of stuns the creep, because he's mad at them. Why not? And then we have Viper, who is contemplating his life choices right now. He's like, what am I doing here? Oh, okay. I'm going back in. Uh, one point in everything. Harassing the Tiny quite well, it seems. Alright. So far, the last hits are ni 9 is the highest at 3 minutes. 3 minutes you should probably have, what's the highest you can get? I think 24 is the highest, so last thing kind of lacking by both sides. I have a feeling that Lifestealer might be, the, might be, might gonna get, he's probably gonna get the highest CS in the, the next 10 minutes because he's just gonna jungle and not care about anyone else. He's just kinda not sure, ah oh, there you go, he uses the uh, rage, he should be okay. So yeah, I, I always wonder which one's better to take, Open Woods or Rage. Open Woods costs a lot more mana, Rage, but gives you extra uh, lifesteal. 
Natural Spirit doing pretty well in the mid lane, I guess. I mean, she has 3 CS, that's not exactly something to uh, brag about. Alright, so Tiny, where is he? Oh yeah, 2-2, two, two, two. not sure why he's using agility threads. It looks like, yep, he's just dead. Could have been first blood. Let's see what. W let's actually see first blood. What happened there? Oh, sorry. Go back. Uh, hook. And there you go. Not the best camera work, but that's what happened. And in the meantime, Viper just kind of killed Zuzus. Was just standing there absorbing hits. Viper decided could have gotten that last hit just now, but is he gonna get this? He is. Honestly, I think he, that was kind of luck. Uh, I'm not sure why. Tiny is sticking with the agility threads. They're okay when you're healing up, but he should probably have. Okay. No toss comes out late, and he looks like he's probably dead. Two points in slow is gonna kill him. That was very odd. Okay. I'm pretty convinced now that this game it is going to be more fun than serious mechanical display of knowledge and uh, concentration. So. I hope you enjoy that because this is this is like the 2k MMR rage or something. Yeah, well, Slaughter, what's he going for? I actually like that he puts a point in bash. I feel like too many people max out sprint when it's it's nice and all, it gives you the extra movement speed, but a one point in bash gives you a 10% chance to land a, a stun. That's pretty good. Does that side actually have a courier? Oh, of course, no wards. Hey, wait, there is one ward. Hey, one more deal. I think the Vengeful Spirit planted this ward very early. Well, actually it has roughly two minutes left, so it wasn't that early. Pudge. Yeah, he's okay. Oh, engagement. I hear music. Oh, wait. No, what happened? I was. I heard the music. I didn't know what where is it. Okay, top lane. Nice. That was nice. Okay, is he, will we get lucky bash? Beautiful. Killed by the creeps. Doesn't matter. He got the kill first. But I like the combination of uh, Astral Precipit and Slithering Crush. It's only one second, but he still managed to screw up his friend. And Omnid going for two points in DJ Arrow. Well, I'm not really sure you need two points. One point seems like it would be good enough, actually. Uh, he throws the heal, and now he's out of mana for the next, like, maybe, I don't know, two minutes. Zeus, just kind of standing there. Look at his face, he looks sad. And he's probably going to die. Buys the boots, that's not gonna save you. Okay, he throws the ultimate as the killing blow. Whatever, he got the kill, he's 3 and 0. Viper dominating his lane. I think he's top of the net worth. Yeah, there you go, top of the net worth. Oh, mid lane. Hooks, interesting. And VS? No, it looks like he has a swap and already used it. How's Life Stealer? How's the Wife Stealer doing? Wife Stealer? Still level 3, that's kinda not that fast jungling, if you ask me. Okay, his rage. I think he's. Oh wait, uh, we need to do this entire team. Sorry, no lisp on the vengeful spirit. We have uh, Riley, Riley X Riles. Maybe some guy in a relationship. I don't know. On Dominite. Office. Oh, I hear a stun. Uh, might have a kill. Office on the my life sealer. Anton Mata on the. Uh, Centaur War Runner, and lastly we have JC Nasty, who has been pretty nasty in the lane, I must say. Not sure why he went went back to base just to refill his bottle when he didn't really need to, but... Oh uh, well, that's that's his decision. Lifestyle just... I don't understand why he's just not jungling full time. He just seems to sort of stand around. He has no slow. He's not going to be doing any damage. And he uses his rage way before he even gets there. And now that he's here, he doesn't have rage at all. What the hell was that decision making process, I wonder? He used rage when he was over here. By the time he got here, he's like, wait, I'm no longer magic immune. What, what's going on? Fire recap. Yeah, let's look at the experience graph experience. Oh, okay, he, now he takes open wounds. If only he had ra used rage just now, he might have actually been able to get the kill. He does have an orb of venom, which is good for killing it. Not so good in the, in the jungle, so. There's that. Tani sticking with the agility threads because he needs it for some reason. Has a bracer. Looks like oh god, Centaur, come on. 
get your head in the game, bro. Centaur, alright. Star is just on one guy, tries to double edge the other guy. He's walking in. He does have Tranquil Boots, which I like. And the cloak is actually a bit more useful this lane. It's against the Tiny and the Zeus, who's. Um, ta Zeus, sorry. Tiny early game damage is mostly magical, so being able to block it. Holy shit! He just threw his friend! And and Centaur didn't even stun him. Uh, okay, alright, there's some weird shenanigans going on, but I think Viper's gonna clean house now. Viper, the best hero in pub games at low level, apparently. Man, that guy completely screwed his run. See, I don't get why he's running back to base when he actually has Tranquils. It's like, he got Tranquils. Ma mid lane, Vengeful Spirit. The hook, will it land? Stun comes out. Can she dodge the hook? No. She, I think she could have actually dodged it if she you know, played a bit better. Uh, Pink's coming out. Where's the life stealer? Life stealer going back to base. Very odd decision for him to go back to base, considering that he has jungle sustain with his feast, but decides to go back to base. Why? Um, oh god. Let's leave the army knight top lane solo, maxing out his purification. That's good. Who's coming top? Looks like Centaur is going to come top. Eh, no stun. I thought when he'd show up, he'd immediately stun someone. He ulties for good measure. And m might be a bottom lane thing. Bottom lane. Looks like the uh, Viper is just going to run. I think she, he can turn around and kill him. But it's a surprise he's maxing out corrosive skin. And there was a kill at the top lane. But, eh, well, there's kills happening all over. So I think we'll see, we'll see, we can see that some other time. Yeah, I'm not sure why Viper is maxing out corrosive skin when he's... You know, doing well by going for the more uh, offensive build, but ah eh, well. Mm, tiny, finally, strength threat. I like that he's going for avalanche and toss because basically, uh, you want to combine these skills. Uh, you can also add grow into the mixture. What about oh, top lane? We have engagement here. Slaughter might be in trouble. Okay. No, no, not enough mana for the uh, hoof stomp, and he'll be okay. All right, so. Uh, what about Zeus? Zeus has arcane boots. Kind of weird skill build, uh, but it's okay, I guess. Generally, you want to go two, th uh, one, three, and one. Uh, okay, might, might have it. Might ha nice, beautiful. Uh, not enough mana for a stun, but still, that was pretty good. He just needs one more hit. One more hit will get the kill. The who? Oh no, Pudge managed to make that alive. And in the meantime, looks like that we had engagement top lane. Stun comes out. Can they actually kill him? One more. There we go. Gets the kill. Hook comes out and nice. Vengeful spirit. Who knew vengeful spirit is, could be this threatening? And she's going for phase boots. Eh, phase boots. Huh? Not sure how that how good that is going to be this game. Anyway, Slaughter actually is a really good, good item armlet. Uh, yes, it's a great item on Slaughter. I like his skill build. I honestly like that he's maxing bash. Maybe it's just me. Oh wait, we have we have a roar coming up bottom lane. Centaur with the big plays. Although I'm not really sure why Tiny just kind of left his friend to die. Tiny kind of. Oh, wow, how did how that's not miss? That is weird. Could just toss him, you know. There you go. This is what uh, Centaur gets for charging him like that. Yeah, I like that Slaughter actually is going for armor. Not sure why it's still on. Oh, there we go. Turned off. Uh, Pudge has a blink dagger. So he's per he's gonna get I think one point in the flesh sheep now yeah, this budge despite his amazing hooks seems to be doing kind of okay at least skill build why I mean uh, skill build and item wise, uh, OD gets swapped S stun comes out a bit late but they get the kill anyway. Meanwhile, it's Pudge and his friend Slaughter. Sl it looks like Pudge was body blocking him the whole time. Can they get a hook? Slaughter kind of blocking his uh, hook path. Okay, they, they ping out, they see him. Yeah, Slaughter really needs to give this guy some space. He's like a clingy girlfriend. There we go. Gets the hook. But Slaughter really needs to stop sticking his ass in front of his face. Which is good advice for m most relationships, I'd say. Anyway. Pudge uh, looks like he's gonna go for phase boots. Not really sure why he'd want phase boots on, on Pudge. Hook comes out. Oh, so close. But this is nice. Centaur Warner actually has the next inside him. I'm, I'm gonna, let's see what's gonna happen. A bit too much uh, lip service coming out from the dire side. Would appreciate if they, you know, 
talked less in general. Slardar. I think he's gonna save up for a blink dagger. Alright, so uh, what about OD? OD has the. Uh, okay, looks like we have engagement here. Nice hook coming out, but doesn't have enough mana to actually bite him. Surprising, because he actually has haste. Oh, okay. Uh, and Nike's still inside him for some reason, not deciding not to come out. Now he's out, about time, but doesn't have a enough mana to actually do anything. And surprisingly, it's a two for one trade in favor of the dire side. I'm not sure why Life Seal so, is such a coward. I mean, why he decides to retreat when he could probably engage. Meanwhile, it's Omni Knight doing normal Omni Knight things, which is jungling. Oh, okay. Uh, Zeus has actually DC'd. This is a very fun game, isn't it? Okay, it looks like Adventure Spirit is actually still alive. Tiny could have used his boots to change, and Zeus has has actually abandoned. That's that's it. Zeus is gone from the game, everyone. He's not coming back. He's literally ju he's just abandoned. What are the games we're finding today? The truth is that there weren't that many games to cast. I mean. There was a game that was that I could have casted, but some guy said he wanted to do it, so I was like, "All right, you go ahead, and I'll cast this game, which is six days old, and no one's casted." But I think I may know may know why no one's casted now. All right. Oh, nice. That was a weird hook. I mean, does he not see that there are billions of people between him and the Viper? That's that's some impressive tunnel vision. Vengeful Spirit, level 11, nice swap, and I don't think Tiny is making out of this one. Sorry, Pudge is making it out of this one alive. He has. She has the medallion, she has the face, but she's hitting pretty hard. Nice. Uh, ultimate coming off the center. Does land his stun and looks like Tiny is probably dead. One more hit. And he's he's gonna fall. Meanwhile, top lane. It is life it is the wife stealer against the OD. Report tiny CTM plus. I'm not sure what that means. Alright. Um oh wait, top lane. When we have engagement here. Life stealer could just turn this around if he wanted to, I think. Yeah, I think he's panicking. Infest? There we go. Nice infest. Okay. How long is he gonna stay here? You know, you could control it if you want to. Uh, OD. Astles himself for one second. Right in time. Oh, nice hook, actually. OD, the, that missed chance is gonna save him. Um, beautiful, actually. This is some amazing stuff happening right now. And Pudge actually gets a double kill. I'd say that there was a lot of misplays, but a double kill is a double kill. And Pudge with the triple. This Pudge doing so much for his team. Alright, lifesteal, what does he have? Okay, I think he I think this guy is kinda lost. You know? I don't know what he's what he's trying to do. He's just kinda running around, not really doing anything. His net worth is, is atrocious. Uh, I don't know. Alright, looks like Slaughter wants to man up. Man up. S the Centaur versus Slaughter. My money's on, sl on Slaughter. Slaughter beating the shit out of him. And Centaur could use his ultimate. Oh, why would... Oh, come on. What kind of ultimate was that? He used his ultimate and stood still. He, your ultimate is literally the exact opposite of standing still. Ay, ay, ay. I'm not sure he's going to build either for the string of regen. Is it the four staff? I hope not. Hook comes out, hooks his friend. I'm really not sure he should have done that because it's not exactly full of mana. But he gets the bottle. Experience. Just uh, the graphs in this game mean nothing because everyone's gonna is playing in this weird alternate dimension of Dota where random things are it's it's happen all the time. It's not really you win based on basically just weird random stuff. Okay, Na th see that? See what happened? <laughs> what the hell was that? And cent the centaur is gonna run away despite being surrounded by four people, three of them with stuns, and they kill a slaughter. How the hell did that happen? Hook comes up. What? Oh my! And the centaur just crazy. Oh hey, that's actually pretty good. Well, not for long, but hey, uh, that survived long enough. Uh, OD, hook comes out, finally hooks an enemy, and OD is gonna die. It's a four for nothing trade. Can you believe it? I, uh, now, uh, well, actually, this is, uh, is AFK, but Zeus uses his ultimate, gets the kill. What? Oh my 
my god. A 2k advantage for the dire, 4k gold, uh, sorry, 4k uh, experience. I'm not sure what, what weed the, the dire side have been smoking, but it looks like some pretty good stuff. Oh, and the radiance. I think everyone's high in this game. Alright, Slaughter lands a stun. Alright, looks like he's probably gonna be able to get the kill. Some insane damage. Did, I don't think he used armor, by the way. I wanna, I wanna say this. Did he use armor or not? Okay, armor's turn. Oh, yeah, yeah, I did turn it off. Okay. Sorry, I did turn it on, I meant. Good work by the Slaughter. Uh, Ventral Spirit, is she going for a Skadi or an Agnums? I think I think for her, and, and th usually I'd say Agnums is a really good item, but Skadi is better this game because, you know, the game is just crazy, weird stuff happening, basically. Right. Uh, what does Viper have? Viper, I'm not sure what he has. He's surprisingly poor, I mean, item-wise. Despite the fact that he dominated his lane, uh, Santa Warner really likes his magic resistance for some r odd reason. I'm not sure why. We might have a standoff here, a three on three fight. My money is on the Radiant side. Alright, Swap comes out. Slaughter just kind of stands there. Nice, get, gets a double stun. Hook comes out. I th oh, beautiful. The Centaur is able to stun him back. Um, looks like they are able to kill the, the Centaur first. Ultimate did come out from Omnid, but it's not enough. He does have a heal, but he doesn't actually heal the right person. And looks like they so far it's a two for nothing trade. Oh, Tiny, he's gonna fall. The hook comes out for the pudge, but they need a bit more. Uh, I think they overextended. And looks like, oh no, actually, no, they get the kill. Slaughter, very nice armor toggle. Honestly, that was incredibly well done. Lifestealer was riding his kaiju, as they call it. And Slaughter needs to be very careful. Turns on his. his uh, Armlet again, very good job by this uh, guy using his armlet. Okay, this is turned off now, I think. And we have a fight here between the uh, OD. Okay, it looks like it's gonna end in a, d in a complete rated victory. They lost the tiny, but they were able to get, I think, five kills. Uh, yeah, I think they team wiped because they killed the uh, Omni Knight and the Centaur early. Omni Knight, when he was here, he should have when he was here, he should have healed himself instead of the Ventral Spirit. If he healed himself, he would have damaged the Radiant Heroes. Uh, no flying courier coming out for me. There's oh wait, actually flying courier the die. I I sorry. But still a ground courier for the radiant, and of course no uh, no no wards because that's crappy TI five bullshit that we don't follow in this meta. And this we're we're so deep in the trench we are basically underground at this point. Life sealer has a Yasha. Why not? You know. Maxed out feast, why not? It's not like he's actually ever landed a physical blow. Alright, we have a kill on the Slaughter. Slaughter looks like he's probably. Oh, so close. If he had used his armor, he might have been able to survive by planning out. I'm, I'm not sure. What, by the way, I'm not sure what, what, what Lifestyle thinks he's doing by infesting people. He's like, he infests and he's just. He's like, yeah, I think I'll, I'll stay inside you for some time. Oh, now, oh, now he's out. Alright. Still, 43, 43 kills, 20, 22 minutes in, that's pretty good. Uh, Pudge, a too, bit too far, they will need to get way at the edge. He'll probably go, he'll probably blink somewhere around here to try and get the hook. Pudge, blinky blinky, come on Pudge. You're not getting anyone from there, trust me. Okay, they need vision. Tiny's walking in, Tiny can't give them, a, they can't see anything, he's pinging. There's a lot of pinging coming out. Oh, nice. And uh, they are able to kill the OD. Hook comes out. Can they kill the life stealer? Tiny throws out the stun. Doesn't actually do much damage to the centaur, but they are able to get it's a one for one trade. Not sure who it favors because net worth is a arbitrary meaningless number. I don't know what arbitrary actually means now that I think about it. Huh. Alright. There's three people on the dire side here. Four. Vipers coming in. Slardar might be in trouble. Slardar. Uh, sprints in, so gets stunned, t uh, heal comes out, oh, that tiny, what the hell was that? A uh, swap comes out, she actually swaps the viper so she can get close. Ultimate coming out from the centaur and they are able, gonna be able to get the kill. So two kills for nothing, pretty cool, pretty cool, not bad. Viper is definitely going for the agonims. That was an interesting swap by the Vengeful Spirit considering that, uh, 
We didn't have a super stun available. Also, I like that Slaughter's going for this minus armor thing, but I think, whoa, hey, I might have engagement here, Tiny. Gets the Astral. I think he kind of screwed him. Oh, hey, actually, not not so much because uh, he three second Astral, he can just teleport. And I, I like that he's going for this minus armor thing, but you need Blink Dagger to get close. Of course, in this game, it seems like all you have to do is wait for Eventual Spirit to swap you into five of, into her four of her allies and you'll be fine, but in general, you really should get your Blink Dagger if you can. Also, it looks like uh, Pudge is also going for Agam's nice hook, actually. That was a bit harder than it looked because he was kind of surrounded by an, uh, enemy creeps as well. Uh, Life Sealer, no idea what this guy's been doing, honestly. He's just... I mean, has he is he in this game? I don't know. Uh, they see him. Sprint comes out. Uh, oh, nice swap. Not sure what it's for. He, he could use his rage. Actually, gets Astral. That's really nice of him. Um, and Centaur walks in without his stun, and it looks like he's just gonna fall. And that, uh, yeah, that that was that was weird. BS wants to get the kill, but she's not gonna get the kill. Is gonna fall. I don't know why Viper uses his ultimate as the killing blow every time. And he's gonna fall. Craggy exterior actually activating a couple of times and killing him. Four for one. Not sure what to say about that apart from uh, people died, you know. I'm not sure. Also, Lifestealer for absolutely no reason never uses his rage when he needs to. And that was one hell, hell of an astral imprisonment where he kind of saved him. And Viper uses his ultimate as the killing blow every time. That, that's that been working out well for them. Also, they should sell the arcane boost from the Zeus. It's not like it's giving them anything. I kind of wish Zeus was here. It would have been so much fun, I feel like. Yeah, yeah this is definitely the kind of game you play either drunk or new. We should make bets about that. Centaur going for pipe. He, this guy had... From the start of the game, he was like, I am going for magic resistance. I'm getting it. And he's got it. Good job, bro. Good job. Oh, immediately Altiza just gets hooked. Hey, and he is dead. All that magic resistance. Not enough to keep him alive. See, I find it very funny that Centaur has, been go has just... He goes in, he uses his, his skills at just random times and... Oh well, Slaughter. Sprints in, looks like he's gonna die. Looks like he wants to get Envy. And, and he, okay, he's Envy now. Can they get a kill? Could use his armlet actually. Oh gee. Uh, I know he's used his ultimate, but I actually can't remember the last time I've seen him use it. Alright, can they get the kill? Can they get the kill? No, they can't. Stun comes out, life sealer, uses his open wounds. And I'm not sure why he's using. Now he uses rage, very nice. Uh, able to get the kill. Hook comes out. Oh dear, he's in trouble. He needs to infest someone. He needs to infest someone. Oh, come on. Maybe she could have stunned the pudge. Maybe saved her friend, but decides not to. Slardar gets a one man's eye. He was hoping for a double, but it's not going to happen. And it's going to be a 3 for 1. Hook comes out. These hooks are so good. Oh, dude, you could have just healed yourself. Why do you ulti? Oh, man. If he had actually. It's a, it's a team wipe basically because Pudge not there. He, all he needed to do was heal himself because it doesn't block magic damage nor does it give you any regen. So it actually does completely nothing against magic damage, Guardian Angel. But, uh, oh hey, ultimate comes up. Viper also has his Aghanim Scepter. Yeah, I'm, I don't know. Army Knight could be making a mech, could be making a Vlad's. Could make you a divine reaper for all we know. This game, I wouldn't put past this game. Experience graph, 2.5k for the radiant gold, uh, well, one, one and a half, I'd say, yeah. And looks like they want to push. Okay, tiny. <laughs> Agility treads, drums, and looks like it's go what's going to be an agonims. Uh, Slardar really wants his Shadow Blade. Again, I, I, it helps him initiate. Uh, I, of course, Blink Dagger is be better, but since the enemy team won't, won't be getting any sentries or gems anytime soon, you know, what's, what's, what's the harm of going for the uh, Shadow Blade? Fudge has his Aghanims. Pretty tanky fellow also. Looks like he might be going for hard next. 
And yep, Zentar just uses his ultimate for absolutely no reason. And Vengeful Spirit is here. Lifestyle actually leaves her when she's being teleported. Oh dear, that uh, Lifestyle just dies immediately. And now they throw. Th uh, okay, Budget is also able to get the kill on the Centaur. Looks like Viper is probably gonna fall. Maybe, maybe stun. Stun. Oh come on! What the hell is Vengeful Spirit doing? She could have just swapped. Why would she swap that guy? She should have swapped the slaughter and gotten a free kill. That was. I'd say uh, that's a misplay, but that's roughly the level of what, what I expect from this game anyway, so... Yeah. Diaskur has also been killed, which is completely weird because it's the flying career. Okay, just heal yourself. Just heal yourself. Just heal yourself. You'll be fine. Just heal... Oh, well. If he healed himself before he got stunned, he would have been fine. That's what I meant. Uh, OD, for some reason, Astral's himself. Uh, I'm telling you, I need to get some of that weed that these guys are smoking. Because that is some strong stuff. Ah, uh, well. Ventral Spirit. Yep, he's definitely going for Scotty. And almost has it, in fact. I'm still not, still not sure what, what Omni Knight is making. SNY finally up on the life sealer. 30 minute SNY with boot swaps the uh, Pudge. Pudge. Uh, is he in or something? What the hell? Oh. Pudge could have actually. I think Pudge could have actually blinked out. Let, let's look at that again. Oh, wait. No, no. Go a bit more. Where's Pudge? Okay. When she swaps him. When she swaps him. Okay. Oh no, he can't blink. That was a she, very good. She used the roar first. That was better than I thought, honestly. <laughs> Sorry. About that. Allergies. But that's actually a pretty good play by the VS. VS is definitely a cut above the rest. VL, VS, uh, Pudge, Slardar. Okay, looks like we're gonna have a kill here. Nice! Yeah, oh, Astral himself. Probably by accident, but still. And they, will they be able to get the kill? They are able to get the kill. And nice ultimate by the Centaur. Centaur, he actually got. He just walks it. Get nice double stun, finally. Dude, use it. Use the double edge. Oh, come on. I mean, what the hell is this? Yeah. Um, where was I gonna, what was I gonna say about this? Oh, swap comes out, yeah. Yes, has the Scotty. She needs to land one hit, and that's not gonna happen. Oh, okay. Does that land the hit before he can use? Can he? Can he actually kill him? She needs one hit. One hit. I will actually she needs a couple of hits. Beautiful save by the Omni Knight. I mean, Sar actually did that very well. He turned off and on his omelet when he, when he was low life. I think he would have beaten her. All right. So what does Viper have? Viper hasn't actually made anything since his Aghanim Scepter. And he's not actually using his ultimate except to kill steal very low life heroes. So it's not like it's going to make much of a difference how he u uses it. Sentai War Runner sticking with the no item build that he's going for. Uh, fascinating fellow this Centaur. Life Stealer also kind of not really d doing anything. Yeah, I was uh, going to discuss. The people who have noticed this game are definitely better than than uh, than you know the average of this game uh, slaughter with his armor toggles this guy's been very good i'm not i'm not really digging the item build so much i would have preferred if he went for pow the power to the armlets were good but blink dag would have been a bit better afterwards i think uh pudge his hooks are weird but his item builds are pretty good and he's, he's 14 and 6 so he's he's doing something right okay centaur uh, oh he's oh look how cute he is yeah centaur is definitely on heroin because this guy, it, I'm not sure what he does. Um, Spiper is pretty good, I suppose. Not sure what he's using. Oh, we might have engagement here. Uh, Life stealer. Eh, I'm not gonna say anything because I feel like I've beaten the on drugs joke to death by now. Uh, Life vengeful spirit is definitely also really good. Uh, also a cut above the the rest. Now here's a question: Which team is gonna win? And there's no rhyme or reason to who you pick. Any team could win this. A any hero can 1v5 the other team. If, you know, so I'm not really sure what how the game is going to go. Okay. Oh, dear. Needs to, she really needs to swap or something. Oh, okay, she looks like she'll be fine. And Slars is going to fall. Pudge uses his ultimate. Hook comes out. Oh, dear. The, the Omni Knight needs a swap or something. Nice heal coming out. 
and Arminite actually is surviving so far. Centaur is here, can he do something? Oh man, can't even land the stun, does that, the other double edge gets the kill. And Omni-Knight makes that life. That was really weird, because I think he could have should have been killed just now. Alright, uh, Centaur War Runner, stun doesn't la land, has it ever. And does get the double edge, now it's time for our OD, OD Astros himself. He has a four staff, will he use it, will he use it, will he use it? Of course not. And Slardar is here, Slardar, use your armlet, bro. Bro, you have armlet. Dude, you know you have armlet? You have armlet! Fine, forget it, screwed. Of course, stun misses for the 17th time in a row. Now he uses armlet. Ah, oh, come on! Oh, no, he can't do it. Team wipe. For the dire side. This game is... You know, I'm kind of having a lot of fun. Usually I try to analyze things, but I'm just like, eh, eh who cares? How many people will watch this anyway? Ah, penis, I think. Danny has his agonims. He looks so cute when he's carrying it. Seriously, that's adorable. Um, Slardar's kind of saving up his gold. I, I think the, the game, yeah, what, what is it? This is like the what you see in a hospital with someone's heartbeat or something. Uh, Pudge, yeah, definitely going for heart. Gonna make him practically invulnerable. Coma! So what is this, Peruvian? Ja ja ja, HDP. Hue hue hue. Uh, OD has the uh, Aghanims. Aghanims OD is... Re I really don't know how good it is, if it's good or not, because... I mean... Uh, OD is... Is he even a hero in Dota anymore? Nobody plays him. Uh, so yeah, basically you use Astral Imprisonment on people, so it could be pretty s pretty powerful. Uh, but... I don't know, we'll have to wait and see. Zeus, for some reason, is being used. I don't really think they should use that. Vengeful Spirit looks like she's going to go for either Manta or... Uh, SNY. Uh, probably Manta. Manta would be pretty good. Like I said, BS, 13 and 5. She She's clearly a cut above the rest of her team. Uh, Omnite going for San. She has a Vlad's and uh, Arcane Boots. Uh, okay. No mech. Though, to be honest, if he got mech, I'm not sure how often he'd use it in a fight. OD might be in trouble. Does have a 4 staff. Does have a 4 staff. There we go, but not going to be enough. How can you miss that stun? How the hell could you miss that stun? That is, oh my god, oh nice Slytherin crush on three. And looks like, uh, uh, what call Pudge of course hooks his friend. Good thing they bought that Zeus, Zeus uses ultimate. And I'm not sure if who's controlling him or not. But, okay, Zeus is now out of the fight. Are they gonna be able to get the kill? They are, okay. Uh, wait, Viper's here. Look, oh my god, okay. That was pretty funny actually. Uh, jump in on the on the Viper by the Pudge. I, I want to go and explain what happened just now. All right. Okay. All right. Look at this. This guy, when he goes here, he's gonna turn off his armlet, but corrosive skin actually is gonna kill him. <laughs> That's pretty cool. All right. I I am still amazed by the fact that Centaur missed that stun when he was like standing right next to the guy who was slowed and stunned when he used Aston Imprisonment oh sorry there's a there's something happening when he used Aston Imprisonment it's like just wait wait for him to come back so that one is going for a blade mail that's actually a pretty good item I haven't actually seen him wait did he, has he used pipe I, I'm I don't want to flame him or anything I haven't actually noticed if he's used or not but if he has then at least the item is kind of worth it armlet coming out on the life stealer who actually who also has a sentry ward hey this is actually something very unexpected sentry board. They actually have a couple of sentry wars. One here, one here. Quero Peck. By the way, this is, uh, I believe this game was played on US East server. That's, so that explains the Peruvians. Osha Kiriko Keripine. Or whatever. I should make fun of other people's languages. That's not nice. Especially considering that someone, one of these players is the guy who actually submitted the game. So I must be, mo I might be mocking him. I apologize for doing that. Words. Centaur on his uh, assassination mission. Alright. Super Ninja. Uh, Centaur. Oh, well, actually, this looks like he's not going to do anything. Right, I'm, I'm next fight, keep your eye out on whether he uses pipe or not. I'm 
I'm not going to say if he's going to use it or not. I'm not going to bet or anything, but I'm interested in finding out whether he uses it or not. Roshan, hey, these guys actually know that Roshan uh, exists in this game. That's pretty cool. All right. Oh, they, oh he tried to use uh, Amplified Damage on him. Hey, Viper walks in, Viper walks out. And, okay, Astral's here. It would be a really good time for for an ultimate. Oh, he just uses Shadow Blade and walks out of here. Th look at that minus armor, minus 20. Roshan's gonna fall so fast. Uh, and there's actually a ward here as well. What is uh, Guys, the Dire team is evolving right before our eyes. And, well, maybe not Lifesteal, who's kind of in the drain. He's like, look at me, I can fly. Oh, it's nice, they swap him. But he, he is the one with the Aegis, but he's gonna fall pretty fast. Um, our OD uses his ultimate, does do a decent chunk of damage. Is anyone dead? Yep, the uh, Centaur died. Oh wait, Centaur did not use his, his pipe, by the way, or his ultimate. Uh, people flying around and being sent into alternate dimensions. And Lifestealer could just rage, but decides, now he decides to rage. Omni-Knight, where the hell is Omni-Knight? What the hell are you doing over there, dude? What about this genius? Oh, come on. Uh, oh, no, is he hit by amplified damage? No? Oh, he's fine. Oh, wait, what? Why did he... How did he break his envy? But it doesn't matter. Looks like he's going to be killed. He, 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 of course... I don't know why he doesn't use repel. Oh, come on. He uses ultimate to repel. To repel. Oh, now he uses repel. Repel removes... Oh, that doesn't remove a guardian. Hey, so you are invincible. Could you heal? Nope, decides not to. But repel people, you can't heal them. That was... Weird. No idea what 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 just happened, but something happened. Uh, Sanj on the omnet. Okay, Centaur uses his ultimate just to rush in. By the time he gets here, he has no ultimate. There, stun. Double edge. Hit. Hit. Hook comes out. Dead. All right, there you go. I'm not sure what he's saying. Okay. The, probably one of the worst people to go inside would be the Nomni Knight. OD uses his uh, Astral for some reason. Alright. By the way, you could just repel yourself to remove Amplified Damage. Fudge is here. No, can't get close enough. Four step on Slogar. Now that is interesting. Uh. Blink, will blink dagger be a lot better? What do who do you get? Who do you guys think is gonna win? Is it gonna be radiant? I mean, we have like what, 87 kills right now. Will it be a radiant victory? It's hard to tell. And okay, Zeus just kind of dying. What's gonna happen now? Ah, SNY comes out. Okay, so this is SNY. So more slows coming out for her. She walks into a hook, which is a bit odd. Oh, nice. Uh, stunned somehow. She stunned him as well. I'm not sure how that worked out. Uh, repel. If he keeps repelling the Vengeful Spirit, that's pretty much the best thing he can do in his life. All right, looks like the... Oh, no. That's not going to happen. And they are going to kill the OD. OD did have his force that decided not to use it. Wait, wait, where did Pudge go? Pudge is here. Pudge is going to fall. No, Pudge. Then could use his force that four kills coming out. Uh, I think four kills, right? Yeah. Tiny's here. Tiny, thinking that he should probably haul ass. Slardar is also here. Slardar might be able to get the kill. She's a pretty tanky woman. This eventual spirit. Oh come on, heal her. Heal. Oh, Army Knight deciding just not to heal. I was just kind of drifting. What is what is this guy doing? Oh, there you go. Army Knight ru literally running in circles. Watch, watch, watch this. I don't care. We're gonna we're gonna watch this again. Look at this. Uh, wait, wait, no, no, we're gonna go back some more. Armit comes here. He's gonna watch him run in circles. He's like, alright, I'm... S uh, s one circle. Uh, t what, another circle? Uh, maybe third time, a circle? Uh, and fourth circle, that's it. Four cir he circles around his penis four times and he, go and he leaves. Oh. oh, now he uses... Oh, now he uses the ultimate! Oh, Slardar. Too fast, too furious, and then just goes envy. Um, he wants more blood. This Slardar, although he should be worried. I think he has trauma over the last time he attacked Viper with his armlet. Uh, it's like, what do I do? What are my choices? What are my options? 
<laughs> Why not? That seems pretty cool. All right. Oh god, 96 skills at 42 minutes. Uh, gold graph squiggles, basically. Uh, experience graph r roughly, uh, slightly more squiggly. Oh man. Never underestimate people's ability to throw, but then again, this game isn't about. There's no. Uh, so, nobody has ever outplayed anyone else. The only thing that I can remember that I thought was really legitimately good was when Slaughter was using his omelet here, like. Thir thir I don't know, 20 minutes ago or something like that. Uh, more penis. Um, I gotta wonder what these people are saying. I mean, wh what exactly can, can Lifestealer say when at, at his performance? Tiny. Oh, he has that weird animation. He he looks like he he's, he has that thing where he looks like he needs to hit the gym a bit. Oh man, he looks kind of like me actually, except more except he's a little more handsome. Uh, Slardar. Uh, kind of wondering what he's gonna make. Pudge does have a uh, ghost scepter. Is he gonna make an ethereal blade? Does he know it doesn't do much? I don't know. Ah, uh, heart comes out on a tiny. That's pretty weird, considering that his attack is real slow. Oh, ho hook misses. Uh, Lifestyle has uh, has now decided to invest in melee creep of all creatures in the game. Um, interesting. All right, they're out. Can they slow him? Can they slow him? Uh, okay, now he uses rage. Nice. Uh, stun coming out from the net tiny. That's gonna be enough. Oh, swap. Can they get this kill? They need this kill. Army Knight doing his circle thing. Beautiful hook. Literally misses, misses them by about, about a mile. And can they get the hit, kill on the Pudge? They need this. A stun does come out. Uh, is Army Knight kind of busy. Oh, this is going to be dangerous. Uh, so I'll just. Nope, nope, he's not going to risk it. Smart decision making, actually. Wards coming out. I'm not sure why they're planting wards in the mid lane when you when you need to put, put some sentries or get a gym or something. Alright. Ah, for Center War. I think he's legitimately my favorite player this game. Oh, beautiful. Uh, he could actually buy a blade now if he wanted to, by the way. I'm not sure why he's not. Oh, Slaughter. He, Slaughter, he's dead. He is so dead. Nice. Uh, swap. And could they kill? Okay, nice ultimate coming out from the Omni Knight. Getting the misses. Repels. Could you, could you throw a heal? And nobody dies. Um, it's okay, at, at least he was involved. I mean, you can't fault him for being in the fight, at least. SNY and Omni Knight. SNY seems to be a very popular pub item. I was looking at how many people have SNY. Where's that? Where's that thing that shows you items? Uh, yes, we have three SNYs on the dire side. I, I'm guessing these guys must be related. All right. The Solar Crest was a very nice pickup by the PS, but. I'm not sure what she's gonna make now. She's getting life steal. Slada, he gives no shit about what your items are. He's gonna walk in tower range. I think they spot him, but no pings come out, so maybe not. His envy. Oh, he has the. Oh, he has double envy. Okay. So, not that much effect on attack speed. Oh dear, they're caught in a very awkward angle. What the hell? I'm not sure. What? 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 What, what the hell was that, Pudge? Oh, vengeful spirit. Nah, she's dead. There's nothing she can do. Pudge sees the enemy, decides to leap into the trees like a gorilla. Actually, gorillas don't go up trees. But decides to go up the trees for no reason. And then just contributes nothing. Oh, P Viper's dead. Yep, she's dead. The odd choices of Shadowblade have been very... Lackluster. Centaur? Oh, come on, Centaur. Come on, Centaur. You f use your pipe. Use your ultimate. Oh, use his ultimate at least. But make no difference. Uh, so no use of the pipe. Oh, dear. Uh, life stealer. Looks like he's going to be okay. I, I have a maelstrom. That's an interesting item. He actually attacks pretty damn fast. Oh, no. That was because of rage. It's still pretty damn fast. Hmm. I think we're heading towards a radiant victory. Alright, life stealer. 
Oh, come on. That was some weird... Ah, Bash comes out. That was some weird... Hey, what? This guy, I think... I think when... When um, Outward Devourer uses his... Uh, Ass on Prism... He's, he's playing Russian Roulette, basically. He's... He's like, I could, I could do this to anyone. Nobody, nobody knows who's gonna get astral present. Some weird stuff. I don't know if the ra if the rating are so confident that they're just. Is it? That's it. Confirmed victory. Pink's coming out. The they're just gonna. Are they gonna throw this? What's gonna happen now? Okay. Omni Knight, nice uh, swap. But he actually puts him right in the base. Uh, Centaur is probably not here. Okay, let's zoom out a little. Get some vision. They do kill the Slardar. And will they be able to kill the OD? They are able to kill the OD. Slider buys back second time. OD also buys back. And they're teleporting to their tier 2 mid lane. That's where they're teleporting. Yep. Tiny just kind of dying. Heart not doing much. And during this meantime, Santa Warner is probably talking to his mother about getting off the internet and studying. Alright, so they killed, they killed three and two of them bought back. Okay. That's weird as hell. So they defend successfully. I would say that of that the radiant had about, had about thirty seconds to beat the throne, but they decided to fool around, and this is the cost of that. But mom, I want to play with all my Peruvian friends. All right, OD is here. Looks like he's gonna go for Octarine Core. Holy shit, Feeble's Octarine Core. That's actually a really good item. Uh, not so good for his arcane orb, but still. And oh, nice hook right through the astral. Um, looks like we might have a kill here. Life Sealer. He's manning up. I'm not sure why he's going for the stronger target and not the weaker one, but they are gonna. Oh, okay, remember he bought back. Uh, there's a fight happening somewhere with the Pudge. All right, now it's Omnite's turn. Omnite has has two spells available that could help him out, but is he actually gonna do anything? Heal yourself, dude. Heal yourself. Oh dear. It's a comeback by the dire side. Then again, they were, the victory was never that far with from these graphs. Uh, Centaur Warrunner has rejoined the game. He, his mom has told him 20 more minutes, and that's it. She's she's plugging the internet or plugging the internet, pulling the internet plug. I think would be the better uh, joke here. Uh, Again, I, I, I'm not sure if, they, they, if all this is trash talk. Easy mid, I'm sure, is what he's saying. Yeah, imagine if all this is trash talk coming up from a guy who is 5 and 18. Something, something, condom. Something, something, negro. Something, something. Don't know what that means. All right, Viper has the Yasha. Yeah, I've the Shadow Blade pickup it makes no sense because you know he's up against a Slardar. But then again, has this game made much? Oh, he actually has a Boots of Travel. That's pretty good. A Mantle Style as well. Uh, buyback. I. Oh, actually, okay, th three people have buyback. They actually have been using buyback. So, um, Centaur and Omnite both have buyback. All right, looks like we have engagement here. Nice stun actually by Centaurs. And will they be able to get this kill? Now he, what, what, what kind of weird ulti is that? Uh. Alright, pinks coming out. At, at least, at least three thousand pinks have been made by the tiny so far. Look at, look at those X's. Look at them. How much? How uh, does he not break his mouse by doing that? My God, I can, I can barely. Can, wait, can I pink? Oh yeah, I can pink. Ah, I can pink too. Woohoo! I know you can pink and replace. I'll. Can I ping a hero? Uh, I don't think. Uh, no, I can't. Oh. Life Steel is inside the centaur. Centaur, if he had a blink dagger, would be one of the best people you could um, infest. Firstly, because he's a horse, but secondly, because you can get close and do a lot of damage uh, with his with their combination. Oh dear! All right, looks like oh Pudge, what the hell is he doing? But uh, he does have backup. Uh, centaur's nowhere around here, and looks like they might be able to kill the Pudge. Pudge is dead. And Slardar, no, Slardar, you don't want to do that, man. Slardar looks like he's going to be building a BKB next. Tower has been destroyed by the Radiant. Not sure which tower it is, but Slardar, Slardar, no, Slardar, don't, don't do it. He, ha oh, Slardar actually sold his uh, Shadow Blade, and uh, 
Just random ass ulti coming out of the centaur as usual. Okay, life stealer. Yeah, there we go. Now the question is, are they gonna ra get a rax out of this? Pudge is dead. It's uh, oh, it's, uh, good job, by this. All right. Looks like we're gonna have engagement here. Can they kill the OD? OD, nice uh, self astral. And Slaw is here. D d actually, almost a double uh, slithering crush. Beautiful ultimate coming out of the OD, but doesn't actually kill anyone. And oh man, OD is, is intelligence is a bit too low. Piper just kind of hanging around. Still no use of the pipe of insight, by the way. You, why, why did he buy this item? Just, just why? He bought it. He hasn't used it. All right, everyone's dead. What will the raid dire team? Do now. Every every single hero on the radiant side is, is, has been destroyed, and dire team, they are pushing in. Will the die? By the way, this game could have been won by the radiant easily if they had just focused on the throne. If they lose this, they have no nothing to blame but their own uh, self, basically. All right, life life story. Look at those armed toggles. Uh, Slaughter. Weird that he sold his shadow blade. Oh, okay, it's actually pr it's it's a decent item on Slaughter this game to have shadow. Not holy shit, he used it. I mean, they ta they're taking very little damage right now. That that's kind of pointless. But hey, he used it. You can't you can't say he never used it. I well I can't say that anymore. Ammonite getting Basher. Yeah. SNY Vladimir's Basher. I have a feeling that these guys are are sort of playing like Dota Bingo or something where you just, you know, pick the most random item you can. Oh, it's not Bingo. Bingo isn't really quite like that. Oh, oh hey, someone's dying. Oh, no, he's not. Life Stealer. What? What the hell just happened? That was weird. Uh, life stealer could actually. Th I think he could actually turn around. I think one hit on Pudge gives you a ton of life. Oh man, hooks. Eh, Sanj. I, I, don't tell me he's going for another SNY. Oh, might be Heaven's Halberd actually. Okay. And he's uh, he's repelled. That's pretty good. Oh, no, look at that life steal. That's pretty good stuff. And all he just hit Pudge. Just hit Pudge. Just infest someone. Uh, just do anything. Oh, now the ultimate comes out from the centaur. And well. He's still here. Will they be able to kill anyone? Oh, come on. They are able to kill the slaughter. Very nice. Uh, for some reason, the centaur dies. Not sure why exactly. He had, By the way, he had pipe for the record. And look at her beating up on this guy. Man, she can barely kill him though. Okay. Ethereal blade. And she... Uh, Pudge is... Oh, no. What? What the? Ah, he's dead. He just showed out of the middle of nowhere. I thought he had Blink Dagger for a second. Alright. Dire just... Uh, creeps. OP. I swear to God. Creeps. Bottom and mid lane. Winning the game by creeps. Uh, MVP easily goes to the to the Dire creeps. These guys have been doing so much work. By the way, what is the CS? Has anyone actually killed anything? No. We're barely cracking. We In a 56 minute game, we... Barely three people go up a hundred CS. Yeah, but look at these. Look at these creeps. Look at them. They're amazing. They they destroy top. Look at these guys. I swear. The I want these guys on my team. Oh well, I, I'm more interested in, wa in watching creeps than the actual game going on. Look at them. Look at them doing work. Amazing creeps. Amazing. Can you believe that uh, that creeps have taken two lanes of racks by themselves? Creeps. Well, it's a radiant. I mean, sorry, it's a dire victory. Congratulations if the guy who submitted this is on the dire side. Consult your doctor if you're on the radiant side because you really threw that game. Hope you guys enjoyed the cast. Thank you for watching, and see you later.